Hey guys, today we're going to look at importing skeletal mesh and the affiliated animation files into Unreal. So to start, I'm going to make a new folder called Avatar Sarah. And in that folder, I'm going to go ahead and import my T pose. Now I could just import the animation file, but we do have more than one animation file. And that's just going to create duplicates of materials, textures, skeletons, etc. So I'm going to grab that T pose. And this is all fine. So I'm going to bring that in. Okay, great. And my materials won't show up right away because my shaders are still compiling, but that's fine. So we get the skeletal mesh, we have our physics asset, our skeleton, and then of course we have lots of textures and materials. This is great. I'm no, it's not in a T pose because we used Mixamo to create a T pose, but that's fine. The retargeting happened and that's all we care about. So now I'm going to grab my animation files and I'm going to grab both of them. Now note that Unreal already found the skeleton. If this doesn't show up, then you, there might have been a problem when you retargeted this data. So we already have the skeleton. And I don't need to import the mesh. I already have the skeletal mesh here. I already have the materials and textures. So I don't need to import the mesh. So now I can import all. OK, great. So now we have this. I'm going to save all. And now I can bring Sarah into my world. If we find animation, I'm going to use an animation asset. And now I have all of Sarah's animations right here. I can also just drag the animation over as well. And then Sarah will be doing the animation when we hit play. And there we go. And now we have Sarah dancing. All right, pretty cool. So in the next video, we'll look at how we can manipulate some of this animation, use some of the detail properties over here, trim the animation files in editor, and more.